Hello, Mike. It's been a while since we played this. But welcome back for more Pokemon White Gold. In the last episode, we became the champions of Johto. In this episode, we're gonna explore the post game. Alright, so first thing we gotta do... Oh, do I not have a flying Pokemon? Okay, uh, I'm gonna cut to Olivine City because that's the first place we're going to. Alright, so first thing we have that's unlocked is down here. And we have Professor Oak right here. All right, Professor Oak, what do you have for us? Yep, he's gonna upgrade our Pokedex to National Dex. And with this, we can do a whole lot more. Just realize, I'm gonna be flying around a lot, and I put the Pokemon that I use for fly back in the PC after flying here. We're gonna need to get him out again. Uh, yep, Repel Effect War off, who cares? Okay, um, oh, if you hear my EC one and then back on, I'm sorry, it's hot. Um, we might need to. Uh, let's leave Cinder in the PC. Alright. Next point of interest is over here, the Safari Zone. I hit the wrong button. Okay, so basically We sh need be waiting for a call, actually. Actually, let's see. Alright. Alright. This is a new feature of it. It's called Area Customization. Basically, this allows you to change what in your, uh, what's in your safari zone. So you just go up here, and you just select the area. This one will switch. There's forest, meadow, savanna, wetland, bark beach, peak, forest, swamp, marshland, desert, mountain, wasteland. I'm willing to bet Sancho will... No, it's something that we don't have. Uh... Mountain? No, we have mountain. Probably desert. Yeah, let's try desert. Yep, and there's a whole earthquake and everybody dies. Nobody dies in Pokemon. Alright. So let's go find ourselves a sand shoe. Uh, this is a mountain. Alright, let's see if we can find one. Nope, it's a Marowak. Alright, sand shoe. Let's catch it. Alright, 
Okay. It didn't catch. And it ran. Okay. Cool. There we go. Second try. It's a mouse. That doesn't look like a mouse. It looks like Armadillo. Let's retire. We gotta show him Sanshu. Uh, there's no PC in here. Let's go to the PC real quick. Alright, I got the Sanshu you want to see. Okay, even though I'm owner, I still gotta pay to use Fison. Okay, that's great. But yep, it's basically all that's new at Sui Zone. Uh, on to our next place. Alright, our next stop is actually National Park. Um, after you beat the post game, oh, not after you beat the post game, after you beat Champion Lance. You'll have more Pokemon that will appear in the bike catching contest on Thursdays and Saturdays. Most of them being uh, Hoenn Pokemon and Sinnoh Pokemon, which is pretty cool. Now next is actually Pokeathlon. There's an old man with Hollywood somewhere that if you talk to you'll do something special so let me just go find okay I'm dumb uh, so only thing that changes is actually the items that you're able to buy from here so you used to be able to just purchase one page worth of items, but now you can purchase two pages worth of items, including evolutionary stones. And there is a certain one that I want to uh, purchase. So, yeah, I'm gonna see you guys on phone quote Monday. Returning to Pokathon Dome on Monday. Going to the prize exchange. Oh I set myself to maximum Athlon points. But it's only for this one item. A dusk stone. Now, what do I want a death stone for? Well, we have someone that can use it. No, not Zappy. One second. Alright. What's this? With that, we only have one team member left that is not fully evolved. Let's be to a Gligar. But that actually brings us nicely into our last and last new area we're gonna cover in this episode. And we're gonna go grab a uh, Typhlosion real quick.
Because now we're able to go up here. He's asleep, don't blame him. Yet yeah, you weren't ever given the chance to be the first here. You might challenge Battle Frontier. Certain rules and limitations, okay. What are you gonna say? Yeah, I can agree. This guy wants his battle points to teach your Pokemon moves. And I think it's the same thing with these two. Yeah. And those moves are... One second. Alright, so for the move tutors... There's a bunch of... Actually, I'll just throw up on the screen. So let's heal up here. So this is set as a respawn point. And what does this say? This is Battle Frontier. I'm proud of trees. Aim for the top. You know what? We will. We had our versus recorder updated. Well, I, I can explain it. Let's look at the upgrade versus recorder though. So, th we could say battle fears for, but frontier records. There's five question marks and our battle points. What are you guys guessing? Tower, hall, castle, factory, not king. <laughs> That's pretty clever. Now, when you're playing in Battle Frontier, you can find items here, like vitamins, power items. Orbs and focus sash, uh, bands and scarves, and one item that we want. It's 48 battle points. And you can get TMs here. Very good TMs, but they're pretty expensive in battle points. So if you're really good at Battle Frontier, you can just grind this area. And this person, you can buy scratch-offs, get berries. And... Right here's a... model for the Battle Frontier. And you know what? 
next time we'll start exploring the battle frontier starting with the battle tower see you guys then